Hi, my friends. Today I want to show you a new digital kit that I made. It's ATC cards, uh, short for Artist Trading Cards. And uh, I didn't, I just fell in love with these small cards because they're so easy to integrate in the journal. So anyway, here's what you will be getting in this kit. There's seven pages in all. So this is like a background. This is, I made eight tags. They are 2.5 inches by three and a half. And that's the regular size of ATC cards. And uh, eight fits in a, in a size eight and a half by 11 letter. Uh, cardstock let's say and um, so this is the background that I used to make the cards and I decided I wanted to let you have the background so you could build your own cards with your own stuff at home but the second card the, the using this same background here this time I added little ladies on it because you know I have a little I love little ladies and I use them everywhere so I just added the ladies here and you get two kits of the, oh, let's see, that's not what I want to show right away. Let's see, let's see. So you get two kits of the ladies. That means 16 of them. So it's the same background for these eight and the same background for these eight. And you get 16 ladies. So you can print these two pages and, um, you add your own quote or whatever you think is missing for that. But after that, I may giving you the same two pages with the background, with the ladies. But this time I've added quotes, quotes that I like or, you know. So these ones are like complete. They have quotes on them. And you don't like the quotes, you put your own quotes. You don't like the ladies, build your own ATC cards with flowers, birds, whatever. So this is the second page with the eight ladies. And these are also the same eight ladies with quotes. Now, these are quotes like that, but included in this kit. You will also get a page of, uh, of words and quotes and phrases that I made uh, with the um, typewriter front, which I think is looks a little vintage, you know, like nobody writes with these typewriters anymore. So I thought that was a cute font to use. And uh, of course, you also get a, a, a very light uh, background to put behind your cards because see if you want the back of your cards to be more vintage, you need to print the background in the back of your cardstock. So, so these are the seven pages you get. So you get one background, one sheet of words, uh, one sheet of ladies without quotes and with quotes, without quotes and with quotes and the background that I used for all of these. So that's seven sheets. Now I'm going to show you um, I what I did. Just let me put this here. Uh, I cut out the ones that had just the ladies, just the ladies, and um, I cut out my sheet of words, I inked them, and just, just had fun using whatever quotes I thought could be cute, and uh, just made these, and... Um, had some quotes to it so I inked them see these I didn't put any quotes yet I could have put some but I didn't so you just ink them and then um, what I did is okay let me move these over so what I did is I just cut my sheet of words and then I inked them And uh, after that, well, I just put in a, let's say, a, you know, just add the quote and it's all ready to use. So that's another thing you can do with these. 
which are a lot of fun. And they're fun to trade. And, you know, when you do these swaps on Facebook and you need to do something homemade, these are great to do. And the thing is, is with the background, there's just about no limit. You can do what you want. You can pretty much do what you want. So, example, I have cut here backgrounds. I have cut up my sheet of eight backgrounds. Okay. And uh, I will decorate them with stuff that is not included in this digital kit. You know, we always have a pile of stuff. So, uh, I will decorate these and show you. I, I won't do it on, uh, on camera because I, I don't know what I'm going to put on them yet. And I don't want this to be too long. But I will decorate them and I will show you the final results. Okay, be right back. Okay, I'm back. And um, I looked around my stuff and I decided to uh, do some. So... You know, all I did was uh, either added a, uh, a sticker, a little quote. Here I had some die-cut birds that I put. Here I used a ticket and a mushroom. Here it's, um, it's a sticker. This is a little die-cut that I uh, used. Here is another flower sticker. And here I had this big stamp with a butterfly on it. I thought that was fun. So I used that too. So, you know, it's like you can use this base here for anything you want. And uh, and yet I have some that are already ready to uh, just ink and put in your albums. So, I mean, it, there's really no limit to uh, how much fun you can have with these. And I hope you enjoy them. And they are uh, on my Etsy shop right now. So you can get these seven beautiful cards, um, beautiful sheets of papers that you can play with. Thank you for watching.